Before starting with this video, disclaimer, this video is only for educational purpose and everything you do is your responsibility because if you overuse or badly use the method that I will show you today in this video, you might get terminated or blocked from Instagram. Okay guys, today I'll show you how you can promote your NFT collection and get a lot of sales from Instagram and especially we are going to use a trick that a lot of people are using it today and this trick doesn't need to do a lot of job and you'll get a lot of sales. So I think you have seen that when you follow an NFT page on uh, Instagram you will start to receive some promoting messages and promoting requests on your DM so for example here on NFT page on Instagram you see that this page has 1.2 million followers what people do here is that they go to followers on uh, an NFT page and they get all the followers usernames and they use these usernames to send DMs or messages promoting uh, their NFT collection they send promotion to their NFT links and they uh, the messages might be for example like uh, yo take a look at my NFT collection or uh, this NFT collection is going to blow up so you should purchase uh, one of my NFTs this is how people get sales and promote their NFTs nowadays on Instagram today we are going to do the same thing by using a bot I'm not really sure if people use bots to do that or they do this manually but today I'll show you how you can do this by using two bots that I have and the first one is to a bot that can scrape all these usernames from Instagram automatically and the second one is the bot that is going to use these usernames and send messages to them so let's start with this so before starting we need to install some prerequisites the first one is to download and install Python so just go to Python download and you can download Python for your computer both for Mac OS and Windows and the second one is a code editor I like to use VS code you can use any uh, thing you want but you can go ahead and download VS Code if you want for both Windows Mac and Linux the bots that I'll show you today works both on Windows and MacBook computer today I'm in a Mac OS and I'll show you how to do that so the first thing is to go to my github account you can find the links on the description everything I, I do here is in the description so uh, I'll go to repositories of my uh, github account and I'll search for the first one the first bot which is a scraper and so just search for scraper and you will find this Instagram follower scraper so just click on it and we are going to download this bot in our computer and start this so click on code here and download a zip file and this will download the bot and here I have my bot downloaded and here I have finder and I have downloaded my bot and extracted it here so I'm going to move this in desktop and I will show you how you can run this bot let's start by going to a terminal so just open terminal terminal in your MacBook and here I'm going to make this larger so you can see easily and I will move to desktop first because I moved my file on desktop to move to desktop just type CD desktop and then LS and here we have the, the bot and now I'll move inside this folder so just type again CD and Instagram uh, dash followers dash scraper dash dash master so press enter then here we are inside and if I type ls again we have uh, requirements run file and readme so now we have to create a python environment so to install requirements you don't necessarily need to do that but I will do that because I don't want to install requirements on directly on my computer so to create a python environment you should use this command python 3 dash m uh, v and V and you can choose a name uh, whatever you want I'll, I'll type uh, ENV and press enter this will create environment and now we have to activate it to activate it just type source uh, ENV slash bin slash activate press enter then now is activated as you can see here if this command doesn't work you should check that you have python installed by checking it you can do uh, python 3 and press enter then if it shows you python 3.8 or something you are good and you have python installed to quit this just uh, press ctrl and z and this will quit this uh, python 3 so now we have uh, environment and now we have to install requirements to install the requirements uh, write this command uh, pip3 install dash r requirements dot txt and this is the command 
we have to reinstall the shar requirements the txt press enter then this will install the files and now we have to run the bot but before running we have to put our credential of instagram so as i said before we need a text editor or code editor so i'm going to use vs code and i have vs code down here and now i have to open uh the folder that i have on desktop so just go to file open actually i have to click open folder so it's file open folder then i have to go to desktop and here i have instagram follower scraper so click on open then here we have the files you have to go to run.py and as you can see here we have these two fields that we have to complete the first one is it will be the instagram account and the password so you can you can use any instagram account it doesn't matter we are just going to use this to scrape the followers so i'll use my account Okay, I put my credentials here in these two fields. Now I have to save the file. To save it, press Ctrl and S or go to file and press save. Now we got this uh, ready and we have to go back to terminal. And uh, to run this bot, you have to type python, python3 run.py and press enter then this is going to ask you whose followers do you want to scrape i want to scrape the nft page followers and now it's going to ask you how many followers do you want to scrape you can choose a number between 60 to 500 uh, this is a limitation because some of computers doesn't uh, scrape more you can try to scrape more but for now i just put this limitation for now just type at 120 for example just for testing and press enter then this is going to download a driver and this will open the chrome browser and instagram page it's going to log in then it will go to my instagram account to the nft page and scrape these followers Okay, now it's uh, done and as you can see here, it saved the followers. It's showing your followers are saved in followers.txt file. And to see this file, just type ls and here we have the file followers.txt and to, to open this file, just type open and followers.txt. Then this is going to open the file and here we have all the followers that we wanted. So if I zoom in here, we have 120 followers username. And I'm going to save this for now and because we need later. And now I can close this terminal, terminate this. And now we, we have to run the second bot, which is the DM bot. Now go to Chrome browser again on my GitHub account. You have to go to repositories and here I can search for a DM. Just search for DM and you have to, to, to click on this this one IG DM bot dash account so here we have the bot and this is the bot that can send messages on uh, Instagram by using usernames so let's do the same thing download a zip now we go to finder and the downloads here we have it so I double click to extract it then I'm going to also move this on desktop so just drag it in the desktop <coughs> Now I can go again to, to terminal. So just open terminal. I'm going to zoom in. And if you go to desktop again, CD desktop. And if you type ls, we have the second uh, folder, which is IG DM bot account. So CD IG uh, DM bot dash account dash main and go inside it. Now we are again here and we are going to do the same thing. Python 3 dash M. Uh, vnv env then we are creating environment we are to activating it source env slash bin slash activate we have activated now let's install requirements uh, pip3 install let me remove this p pip3 install dash r requirements dot txt enter let's install the other requirements then now we have to open uh, and to put our account information so let's open again vs code and file open folder then we are go to desktop and here we have igdm bot account main open it up the first thing here is to go to infos folder so here will be the infos and uh, we go first to account json and here you have to put your list of accounts the bot is going to use uh, multiple accounts so 
you can do it with multiple accounts but also you can put only one account but i recommend you to use a lot of accounts if you want to use multiple accounts just copy this one copy and go in below and paste it below paste paste and you can use multiple don't forget to put the comma and to remove the the ending comma here and this is the format you can do multiple accounts but for now i'll delete these and i will use only one account just for testing so i'll put my password in it and don't forget to save the file and close it then the second one is messages.txt so here we are going to put our message our nft promotional message for example i'm going to get a message from someone that sent me on uh, Instagram requests. For example, I received this a promotional uh, message from this guy and I'm going to copy this one just for testing and the format they do and just copy this. And all you have to do is go back to VS Code and remove everything here on messages and paste it just like it is like this. And make sure to remove the spaces. So make sure to remove all these spaces and save the file. And if you want to put multiple messages, uh, you should do one message for each line. So for example, if you wanted to put another message, just press enter, go to the next line and put another message and go to the second line, uh, the third line and go uh, put another message. But the bot is going to use randomly one of these messages. But if you put one in, on the one message, it's always going to use this one. So save this file and close it, then go to usernames. And here we have to put the usernames that we scraped before with the other bot. If you save them somewhere, here I have the file. I can copy all of these and I'm going to paste them here on a uh, follow usernames.txt. So save them. What we have to do now, we have just to run the bot. And to run it, go back to terminal. Here we have terminal. And we are going to run the file uh, with this command python3 run.py. Press enter, then this is going to start immediately the bot. So I'm going to drag this on here. This is the window, you should keep it like this, don't maximize it, and then it is going to log in and do their stuff. As you can see, bot is running as is writing the message here. Now it is sending it, and as you can see, we send the message, and now it will go to the next one. Okay, now it's going to the second account and it's sending another message. As you can see, the bot is working perfect and it will send a message again. You can write any message you want, how long you want. You can mention your page on the messages, but you should take care of not overusing this bot or you should put a lot of accounts on it. This bot is going to send 10 messages for each Instagram account you put in accounts.json. So remember this, this bot is going to send 10 messages for each account you put on account.json and after finishing all the accounts it will loop through them and go again to the first one and loop all the accounts again this is how it works i recommend you to put a lot of accounts and do this for with a lot of accounts and different messages so you get don't get banned and blocked from instagram